Okay, so on this problem, they're giving us matrix B, which is a big old matrix and matrix F. They're both three by four, three down, four across, three by four matrices. And they're wanting to say, hey, take four times matrix B and add to that two times matrix F. So that's, that's not too bad. So we'll just take, um, uh, so we're gonna multiply four times all these, like four times five, and then add to it two times matrix F, two times zero, like that. And then we just figure that out, whatever that number is, just come on down here and do that. And that's, uh, what's that, 20 plus zero? That's just 20, isn't it? And then we do the next one. It's four times minus three. Uh, plus two times four. I have to make my pen a little smaller. It's hard to squeeze all that in. So that's going to be what? Minus 12 plus eight minus four. All right, next one is going to be four times seven plus two times minus five. And so it's what's that, 28 minus 10, 18? Now you can see this is a little tedious, right? I'll show you how to do these on your calculator soon as well, if you have a, if you have a graphing calculator. And I'll show you how to do them on um, a computer algebra system on the computer as well, just so you have some other tools. But let's for, let's finish doing this one by hand. Four times eight, and plus two times minus. What's that? Thirty-two minus four. Twenty-eight. Thirty-two minus four. Yeah, twenty-eight. Okay. Next row, and we're one third of the way done. Four times ten. Two times plus two times minus one. It'll be 40 minus two, 38. And four times minus five. And two times minus six. Plus two times minus six. What's that? Minus 20 minus 12 minus 32. Minus 20 minus one minus 32. Yeah. Next one. Four times four and two times minus four. Four times four plus two times minus four. What's that? 16 minus eight, that's eight. And four times minus seven plus two. It was minus three. So minus 28 minus six. Minus 28 minus six. It's at minus 34. All right, we're two thirds of the way done. Last row. Four times one. And then two times six. Four plus 12, is that 16? And then four times three. And then two times minus 10. The 12 minus, <clears throat> 12 minus 20, <clears throat> excuse me, 12 minus 20 is minus eight. Two more, four times minus eight. And uh, plus two times seven. What's that? Minus 32 plus 14. I don't even know what that is. All right? Minus 32 plus 14, 20, 18, minus 18. Right? And last, uh, four times minus six. And two times plus two times three. Minus 24 plus six, what is that, minus 18? Yeah, 
All right, there we go. There's the answer. It's quite tedious. Again, I will show you how to do this on a um, graphing calculator and also on the computer on a website, GeoGebra. Um, I'll show you how to, how to do this in a little bit on another video. But um, there it is by hand. It's just pretty tedious. There we go. It's really made for computers, not humans. <laughs>